Hi, welcome back to World World Reviews. This is Cody Williams, and we're here to talk about the movie Gangs of New York. Directed by the legend of cinema himself, Martin Scorsese delivers us a masterpiece that is something truly majestic to behold. It is a historical crime drama on a scale of epic proportions that seemingly doesn't get the appreciation that it so rightfully deserves. Compared to Martin Scorsese's other films, I have to say that this particular one is hands down one of my favorites. Loosely based on a true story, this movie is inspired by actual events that happened in New York during the mid-19th century. However, this film embellishes some things here and there. The movie story follows young Amsterdam Valen, who happens to witness his father being killed in a major gang brawl and is then exiled away for his own safety. Sixteen years pass and he returns to a gang-ridden Manhattan and the most powerful gang of them all are the natives, with Billy the Butcher as their leader. Amid the violence and corruption during the Civil War, Valen then tries to establish himself in the area and plans to seek revenge over the death of his father. I will admit when I first saw this in theaters as a 12-year-old, I liked the movie at the time, but I didn't have the appreciation for it like I do now. Let's just say that it took many more rewatches to fully cherish the movie's value. From the beginning all the way to the end, the movie's allotted runtime of 2 hours and 45 minutes somehow seems to go by pretty quick. That's how you know how fascinating a movie can be when you're completely compelled by it and you simply just don't care about anything else. I couldn't imagine anyone not liking it, but what is there not to love about this riveting movie? It has an elaborately written script, splendid acting by everyone, and beautifully shot cinematography. I would never have imagined Peter Gabriel's song, Signal to Noise, being used during the opening fight scene, but it's so astonishingly well done. I know it's hard to believe, but somehow it fits. We have a lot of great talented actors in this movie. When I say a lot, I mean a lot. We have Leo DiCaprio, Cameron Diaz, Daniel Day-Lewis, and many more. I could go on, but I want to spare you from being bored. I don't mean to undermine anyone else's performance, but Daniel Day-Lewis is just fantastic in this movie as Billy the Butcher. Why he didn't win an Oscar for his role in this movie is beyond me. The costuming department pulled off the amazing feat to make everyone look the part with 19th century attire. Along with the art direction that was utilized, this is a very immersive movie. Just by looking at everyone and everything throughout the movie, I actually felt like I was transported to a different time period. I'm going to go out on a limb here and say that this is a flawlessly well-crafted movie. I mean, literally everything about it is perfection. When it comes to movies in general, I just wish other movies had the aspiration to be as good as this one. Then I do remember to myself that we do have to have bad movies to help us have appreciation for good movies. Overall, Gangs of New York is hands down a completely transfixing experience that is not to be forgotten. There is no doubt that Martin Scorsese is a master of the art of film. As far as I'm concerned, this movie is mind-blowing with how amazing it really is. I give this movie an A+. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Keep up with my real reviews.